Representative Poha. <laughs> wow, um, the chair comment. This is not about the uh, state hospital, so <laughs> hey, unless you. other colleagues want to continue that line of questioning. I, this is regarding uh, our high five redemption program. <laughs> not another happy subject, but uh, in my district, it's all along the north and northeast coast of Oahu. And we've had two Reynolds Recycling uh, Redemption Centers close, uh, rendering most of our community unable to participate in that program unless they travel in excess of 20 miles plus in one way or another. This is a concern of my community. So I'd like to know what's happening with that. Um, and I obviously I know you cannot control particularly what Reynolds does, but I'd like to know what are, what are some plans that are coming down the pipe. Thank you for that question. I'll have to, uh, Darren Park, who's uh, the manager for the uh, I-5 program, answer that. Hi, good afternoon. Darren Park, coordinator, Office of Solid Waste Management. Um, that's good you asked that question. Yeah. We, you know, we have an update for you. Uh, right now, what we're doing is we're actually engaging property owners out in your district, and that in includes uh, uh, meeting with uh, Hawaii Reserves, and uh, we're working closely with Hawaii Reserves right now. Uh, as you know, they're a um, major landowner out in there, and um, we're fortunate that uh, they're going forward with making um, some sites available for potential redemption centers in your area. Uh, within the last week or so, we took a look at, I believe, uh, three or four parcels that they are looking at to make available, make improvements uh, for future redemption center sites in your community. Thank you for that. Um, and just related to other of my colleagues' areas, are there similar plans that you're doing to engage with uh, other districts where some of this service, this level of service has dropped out? Uh, yes, we're, we're looking at other districts and we're trying to engage in you know, other uh, major property owners in, in those districts and uh, we're in communication with all of them right now, so we're looking at options. As you know right now, uh, because of the you know, improving economy, uh, finding properties are, are, or vacant properties that are not slated for some kind of redevelopment is very difficult these days. So uh, what we're facing is uh, situations where if you do have an open vacant lot, uh, usually the rent is going to be very high or it's just not available at all. So we're looking at all options right now. Thank you so much. Thank you, Chairs.